OK, so in order to look at our um, chromatogram and mass spectra associated with each of the peaks, we'll click on View, and then Mass Hunter Qualitative Data Analysis. And uh, we're going to make sure that we get our sample selected. So I'm going to open this. This is the sample that we just ran. I'm going to close this to show you how to get that. So here's the chromatogram. Um, this is the chromatogram with the retention times labeled. OK, so we can integrate our chromatogram. And the peak areas are associated that are associated with each peak are located in this table at the top. You'll also get peak height and peak width, and full width at half max. But let's say we are interested in uh, the mass spectrum for a particular peak. So we can double click on the peak. It opens up the mass spectrum for that peak. And then we can right click and then search using the NIST mass spec uh, program. And um, it'll pull up a series of results with different probabilities, uh, different match levels. You can click each of these options okay, and see uh, the structure, see the mass spectrum. Uh, you can compare what you, the experimental one looks like with the NIST database uh, and things like that. So you can come up with um, the likely analy analytes that are in the mixture.